Good evening and welcome back to Factorio, where we still don't have any power and I'm still joined by Nerdog Emma. Hello, Nog. Hello, hello. How are you? Yeah, I'm pretty good. I'm pretty good. Oh, good. Uh, awesome. Awesome. Yeah, we still we still have you? no power. We're still trying to get the power source working. We do have a coal mine, but I don't have any inserters to uh, fix the coal mine. But you should I have. I can't remember where inserters are being made. Right here. Here they are. Maybe. Perhaps. No? Inserters are being made. There. There. Here. Uh, you've got a jetpack. I've got legs. Yep. That's something oh. I did not say as well. But, uh, I did build a, a module armor between uh, okay between episodes, and we got some legs, so I can run faster. Yay! Oh, cool. Oh yeah, you are outrunning me. Uh, that's not fair. And don't walk on the tracks. But well, you can fly. So. Yeah, that's true. And we have so much unlocked. Um, unfortunately, you can't build the personal uh, RTGs unless you have uranium fuel cells. Oh. So, yeah, we need to get into nuclear power through there. I'm going to go and get my tank because I have a strange feeling biters are going to come bite me. Hey, because they do that. They do like biting. I certainly do. Do you have power going all the way down there? Yeah, you do. Yeah, it is power going down there. There's just no inserters to take anything off the belts. Uh huh. And uh, as you probably saw from that there as well, there is now a train line running straight through the middle of the base. <laughs> yeah. Because it needs must. So, uh... Oh. Oh. Uh... Okay. I did have a lovely thing. Um, I drove all the way down to the stone mine uh, that I built down the bottom to mm -hmm. kill some biters. Just killed them as my tank ran out of fuel. Oh. And uh, then was like, ah, chop down trees. <laughs> <laughs> and the tank moves really slow on wood power. <laughs> Who'd thought that a tank running on, on wood would uh, would be slow? Yeah, that's weird. But oh well. But yeah, I think the, the plan is nuclear, nuclear power. That seemed like a really good idea. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, we basically don't have enough power for anything right now. Nothing is going. Why? Is our power our power's completely dead? Yeah. I can never tell when it's day or night. Because, uh... Well, it's daytime, I think. Yeah. But we don't have any power at all. Doesn't seem like it. Hmm. Lord. 6.9 uh, megawatts. We We're producing 6.9 megawatts. And we need 1.2 gigawatts. All wrong. Um, I don't actually want those there. Because this train only needs to be two carriages long. So there's no point in putting more in and wasting uh, power. No. Power. So how the heck right. do we get uh, enough power going that we can actually run some coal? Yes. Is my answer to that. Okay. That was helpful. Thank you. I tried. <laughs> to be a little bit careful about where I fly because I don't have that much whoa I don't have that much fuel left oh, I have iron plates okay well I can take out this entire center rail it does not need to be here anymore let's do that because we're not using it, and it will save me on signals. Well, if you... Uh, well, oops. we don't even have enough power for our... 
for the inserters to work so that we can insert stuff in the trains. Yes, that is a definite thing. It's kind of problematic, really. Now, something is being attacked. Ah, uh, dang it. The biters are becoming bitey. Yes, they are. Stop abusing that we don't have power for our defenses. What are they attacking? Uh, accumulator production. Oh, I was right there. Uh... Let's just set a couple of turrets up here and to at least not 100% defenseless. Defense Let's yeah, I need to be careful in driving the tank because the tank will uh, destroy a train, not the other way around. Oh, okay. Rather than getting squashed by the train. Uh, you'll blow it up, so. Yeah, that doesn't sound ideal. No, no, it's probably not. Mm. So what do I need to get nuclear power going? Should have a little bit more power going now. So that hopefully oh uh there's no radar at the coal. Correct. Right. We have no power. We do. So it's bare minimum. It's not even got any defenses. <laughs> Just dumped all the wood I had into the uh, fuel system, so. Okay. Not that that's going to particularly help that much, but. It helps some. Um, right, yeah. Is... Oh, yeah. I need to 500 advanced circuits. We don't have anywhere near that amount of advanced circuits. Uh, I think we might have. Um, I have. 243 on me. I need 500 advanced circuits, uh, heat exchanger, steam turbine. They're not difficult to make, they just require lots of iron plate. You should be able to get 500 advanced circuits, I think. Then we can build a nuclear reactor. Okay. It's a start. Give me your iron plate. How many advanced circuits do you have on you? Uh, 69. Okay. These advanced circuits are these. And I can't remember what the ratio is. Um, I, I only built it like 300 episodes ago in the previous playthrough. Yeah. Um, Don't we have another one as well? We've got a fuel fluid... Oh, no, that one's no good. We do have electric boilers as well, which would... Electric boilers? Yeah, they don't require fuel. They use electricity to produce electricity. Okay. I just don't know whether... There, you have all the advanced circuits you need now. Oh, thank you very much. Uh, copper and steel. Copper, 
steal. Boop. More steel. More steel. Nuclear power. Cool. We don't have any uranium or anything to go with it. Oh. But we did find another. Uh, yeah, we have 448k uranium down here. Hmm. I do wonder whether throwing the electric board is in, whether we're producing enough electricity. I don't uh, know. So these can produce 900. The electric boiler uses. Ninety percent. We're making heat shielding as well, aren't we? Yes. Give that a try. Should we just change some of them to electric boilers and see? Yeah, we can try. Where, where are we making heat shielding? Uh, down where we need heat shielding. Does that help? Yes. No, it really doesn't. Where? Where? I assume it's on the end of the belt. Yeah. Um, we need. I heat don't know what we need heat shielding in. That's the thing. I, don't uh, know. I think it's in the electrical mining. No, the electrical furnaces. Not too far. Give me your heat shielding. Yoink. Might be worth just to try to see whether it works or not. I mean, it says it uses um, maximum consumption is 5.17 megawatts, which is more than it would. How much do they out? produce? But I don't know how much uh, steam it produces. Um, yeah, no it idea. It doesn't say. Whereas the, the boiler produces uh, 60 steam a second. That one, it does not say on it where it produces steam. What okay. it produces a... I think it's not. I don't think it's going to be as effective. No, but... probably not. We can just Surely add them. Worth maybe. No, 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 well, I was just going to replace like one one lane with them. Yeah. Uh, the problem is that we don't have any power now to give to that. I think. What are we going to do? Just do. But I don't know whether that's going to be worse or or not. We'll see when daylight comes around, I suppose. Uh, I don't think we'll be uh, producing enough power from from the um, solar panels to do that. You see that? The solar panels can produce a total of 6.9 megawatts. Oh, but there's coal here, and we just need to go grab it. <clears throat> we actually just need... Power, you know, yeah, there's, power. Just, there's just no power to move the inserters around, is there? So. No.
Well, that's some power. Are they actually doing anything? It doesn't seem like it. I've got no recipe. Uh... Oh, we need to set the uh, what, recipes. What, what temperature do... 165 degrees. Okay. That's okay. So that ah, so that means that 5.7 megawatt, I assume, is... Um, if they're using like, maximum temperature? Yeah. So if they're running on their second to lowest setting... And they're not running all the time either. By the looks of it, output is full on a lot of them. That might not be too bad, actually. That might. Well, these these uh, steam engines are definitely not running at max. Uh, yeah, they are. It's just that our, our the power output. It, it, don't forget they scale. Steam sta scale is based on how much power we need. Oh yeah, that's true. So when the solar panels are running, these will use less fuel. But if switching them over to running on purely electric would be a good idea, we could save on fuel. Yeah. I'm not saying run all of them. I, I definitely think we should have a mix. Yeah. That, that's, a, that's a definite, I think. Because uh... the, the boilers are running all the time. They seem like they're constantly running and outputting water, outputting steam. Yeah. Um, whereas these ones, they sort of stop and start. So yeah, they do. So we get a spike in our power, and then the power. Yeah, if you look at the power grid, you can see the spike when the boilers kick in. Oh yeah. It jumps up to a, a high use and then goes back down again. So. Yeah. Uh. Okay. So, if we connect the base up now, will we have enough power? Yeah, see what happens. Well, the base is connected up. And our accumulators are currently discharging, apparently. Ah, yeah. So when the uh, the electric boilers kick in, we're not generating enough power. No. Hmm. You actually. Uh, I want to make another one of these. I want to have a look at the recipes in them. Zero point six six crafting speed to get hundred and sixty five. And this heats water up to I don't know what temperature. Hundred and sixty five degrees. Ah, uh, it's a completely different mechanic, that's the problem. They do the same thing, but it's just a completely different mechanic. I wonder whether okay. we could put another steam engine on the end of the uh on the end of these ones with the electric boilers. Yeah, that could be. Worth a try. I'm randomly experimenting now. When I should be working on nuclear power, but you know. Yeah. Data formatting, rough data storage, substrate, polished data storage, substrate, polished data storage, substrate, blank data card, machine learning data, Jesus. Oh, they just fit. That's lucky. Yeah. It does seem like uh, it can handle three. Doesn't it? 
Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. It definitely sees that, but it's definitely it's not getting enough power. They they are, yeah, yeah. We're now using twenty eight megawatts on the electric boilers. Okay. And they produce nine eighteen. They they produce two point seven megawatts and are using five point one seven. So no, they're not they're not good. Okay. But that doesn't that just mean that we need to put more. Uh... Uh, more, uh, what are they called? Steam engines on an electric boiler? Uh, yeah, but can can an electric boiler support more than... Because if it's 9, hold on, 5.17, uh, 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 5.17, right, uh, divided by 9, you... Uh, I mean, it can't be right that... It's you losing need more six, power. You need, you need six boilers, mm -hmm. uh, six steam engines to power an electric boiler, and I don't think it can generate enough steam for six boilers, six steam engines. But then, what's the point of them? Yeah, that 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 is kind of the thing. Yeah, that's that's kind of the thing. I do wonder what is the point of it. Um, I do have a couple more, so we can test it. Yeah. So, oop, oop, uh, oop, there's six. Yeah, you need 5.71 or whatever it is. Um, do these need to have no, power next to them? Substation. That is actually running. It's not 100%. I can see the steam sort of dipping down. Yeah. But that is running. So... Which means, because we don't need the, uh, the burner inserters here grabbing fuel, we could actually have one electric boiler for six steam turbines. Yeah. What are you doing? Uh, I'm gonna run one for six. Ah, okay. Then no, we don't need that there. Uh, that does not connect up there. That's annoying. Oh, I need more. Uh... You can't do that. More pipes. Look, it doesn't I connect up. Do it doesn't connect what up. It doesn't connect up. If you look here. What do you mean it doesn't connect up? Look. Uh, maybe. I've got to move some pipes. And so I if you put it there. there, then it doesn't connect up. Oh, now it does. Okay, you have to set the recipe. Yeah, it needs the uh, recipe. Doesn't it? it needs the uh, 165 degree recipe, yeah. Yeah, so that should be a pretty easy fix. Yeah. Nope, and they 
should now be able to produce enough steam to run all six of those, or just under all six of those. Yeah. Uh, but they initially need to uh, get their charge going. Yeah. Because right now we don't have enough electricity. But once they do, they will be producing uh, nine times six. Uh, nine times six, please. They're producing 5.4 megawatts. Okay. And using 5.17, so... Uh, the I don't weird... know whether that's any good or not. No. The weird thing is, it says... Uh, create steam for water using electrical energy. 90% energy efficient. Yeah, so I wonder if it's not, it's losing... I, I don't know, it's weird because it doesn't... It doesn't tell you the actual output of steam. That's no. the problem. Yeah. Whereas the boilers do tell you the output of steam. So I have a feeling this is not. This is not. This is kind of pointless. I mean, this is going to work. And it's going to produce electricity, but it's not going to produce a great deal. No, I don't think it's worth um, it. But it does mean that you're not using fuel. So yeah, if you can put it out somewhere and kickstart it with a bit of uh, solar power. Yeah. It could produce power. Mm-hmm. But as the daylight comes back, hopefully very soon. Well, we're actually not on any daylight whatsoever. Well, that's okay then. So the, these are slowly producing more power then, because it's night time. And the actual, if you look at them, the electric bar was in red and that's in yellow. Yeah. Yeah. So they must be producing some form of power because our power grid's getting stronger. Yeah. And then when the sun comes out, it'll get even better. Yeah. Other than when lasers attack things, like just happened there. Yeah. Oish. Uh, the stone outpost down here is going to go down. Uh, yeah, unless power can get to it. You're taking the tank? the tank? I'm going to take the tank. I don't remember where I put it. There it is. Oh, that might be quicker to catch a train. There is one problem with the one train thing, and that is that we're not getting enough coal. Uh, well, there's no coal being produced, is there? There is. Well, there's a train yeah, dropping off coal right now. Yeah, but because the power's low... Yeah, that's true. It's not, it's not picking up the car or dropping it off anyway. It's not running at speed. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Jim, Jim, Jim. I don't have any fuel for you to use. Oh, yes, I do. Ah, down cliffs. Some sort of pass. How many did I get? Almost a hundred. Nice. Can you handle them? Yeah, I just need to get it. <laughs> That's the problem. <laughs> They've taken out the power to the actual outpost. That's why they're destroying it. Oh. They've taken out the power pole. That's the one corner nice. they attacked where I had power, where, the, where the power was connected into it, they attacked. <laughs> of course. There we go. Something like that. 
There we go. And we fit one more of these in here. I don't think we can. Oh no, I run out of walls. It's not good. Nope, just. Okay. Um, where is there a nice space to put in some solar panels? No, up here actually. Isn't the worst. Yeah. Forces corner with standard walls. There we go. <laughs> there we go. We are back in business. There is a Ooh. huge bite space right next to me. Okay. Which needs dealing with, I suppose, but it is rather on the large side, so I will do it next episode. Yeah, that is pretty big. Yeah, uh, I guess uh, next episode will have to be the episode where you take that out. Or get taken out. We'll see. We'll yeah. See. But either way, we shall leave this one here and uh, come back next time. Yep. So, thank you all very much for watching. We hope you have enjoyed this one and hope to see you again in the next one. And until then, as always, have fun. Bye-bye.